But we do like to show you things that happen when nice weather happens here, <laughs> right, at the Weather Channel. In fact, you can use it to help others less privileged than yourself. Right, and sailing might be a way to do it. You can, in fact, use it to get others involved in learning about weather, getting out on the water. Rick Adams went to D.C. and set sail to tell us a little bit more. Sailing, just me, a ship, the weather was my guide, and some kids. Wait, what the heck? Is this a good idea? Yes, DC Sail teaches kids to harness the elements with a scholarship for those less privileged like Fortune, who's now an instructor. Hi. It's changed my life. It's really taught me how to open up. Captain Matt Vilbus helps kids study the weather as they sail a schooner. It brings all the kids from all different backgrounds into a program here on the American Spirit, and it gets them all in the same playing field, literally the same boat, that they have to work together as one team, one body, to get this boat on and off the dock every day. Scholarships are part funded by the private hire of the ship. Ready to raise the main? Ready! That's it, you dogs. Keep, keep pulling, you dogs. Learning how to ride the wind and waves is the most important lesson here, along with teamwork. Nice. Look at that. And the chance to pass it on to others. Yeah. Volunteering gives me like a rush. I don't know. It's it's I'm really tingly right now just talking about it. It makes me feel really nice. All the staff at DC Sail, they really worked with me. I'm dyslexic also, so they really helped me. If I see other kids like, having trouble, I'll go and I sit with them and I'll be really patient and I'll help them out no matter how much time they need. So, Captain, I feel I've got a lot of skills. I mean, where can I be useful on your ship? All right, all right. What do you think, gentlemen? The brig. Oh, the brig. Let's go to the brig. OK, ah. let's go to the brig. Wait, no, no, no. Guys, Hi, guys. Are you sure you don't need my help? No, sir. Oh, OK. 